Hey guys, it's Siridan, and today we're doing a review of the Nerf Star Wars Stormtrooper Blaster. So the Stormtrooper Blaster was released in 2015 to promote Star Wars The Force Awakens, and it's designed to be a blaster that the Stormtroopers use, which is probably why it's called the Stormtrooper Blaster. So the Stormtrooper Blaster isn't really that big at all. It's, in fact, it's quite small, and it's basically a snapfire reshell, because you've got this priming thing here which is very small draw so it's probably got similar internals to the snapfire and it gets about the same performance and it's also has a tactical rail on top and you'll notice it's the new style that they are doing and overall it's not too hard to shoot you just prime it with this and put a dart in the front and then you pull the trigger and it shoots like a jolt so there's not really too many other features on the Stormtrooper Blaster, although originally it would have come with some sort of weird Star Wars sight, but since we got our second hand, it didn't come with that, unfortunately, but that's pretty much it for the overview of the blaster, so now we're going to move on to the range test. Hey guys, it's Tom, and today we're here at the range to range test, the Nerf Stormtrooper Blaster. So we're just going to be shooting elite darts, because that's really all it shoots. Anyways, starting off with flat shots, let's go. Okay, now angle shots. Okay, that's it for shooting the darts. Now let's check the range. So our first shot here is between 32 and 33 feet. Our next one is kind of around 40 feet. Next one's at 43 feet. Next one's at around 46 feet. Next uh, around 47 feet. And up here our last shot is around 53 feet. Okay, that's it for our range test. Now on to the conclusion. So overall the Stormtrooper Blaster is an okay blaster. Not really the best performance because it is pretty much a snap fire, but it's alright for its size because it's a pretty compact blaster, as you can see there, but I don't know if I'd really recommend it unless you're a big fan of Star Wars blasters and this really appeals to you, then it's probably a good blaster to have because you can at least have it as a prop if you don't really mind that it shoots like a snap fire. So since the movie that it was promoting came out quite some time ago, a few years, it's not really available in stores anymore, so if you want to pick up one of these, you'll probably have to resort to thrift stores or secondhand sites because they usually don't keep the promotional blasters around for too much longer after the movie's done, and in this case, they're all gone. So if you want to find one, you may have a little bit harder luck than finding the new recent Star Wars blasters. So that's it for this review of the Nerf Star Wars Stormtrooper Blaster. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe.